Hey guys, welcome to my channel. My name is Stephanie. In today's video, I'm doing a little bit of a haul. Um, this is just what I've purchased this past week. I went shopping at Zara, um, Bershka, and Stradivarius. I think I'm saying that right. Uh, I will just hop right in. Um, there are a few pieces that I already wore. I literally wore just this weekend. Um, it was my birthday um, recently, so I went out for my birthday. Um, and yeah, so I, I did actually happen to like literally just wear a couple of these things on the same day I bought them. But yeah, I think everything should still be available online. So I will link all of that down below. The first um, piece is this quilted jacket from Stradivarius. Am I? Yeah, yeah Stradivarius. I know I feel like I'm not saying that right. But anyways, um, I got it in a size small. Um, it's relatively lightweight, but it still feels like it'll keep you warm enough. Um, I really like that it has, I like when jackets that are shorter and fall at your waistline. I like it when they have something that kind of cinches it in at the bottom, like it gives you that option to kind of tighten it. Um, it's actually, it's, it also says that it is water resistant which I really liked. Um, yeah, I live in Ireland and you know, it rains frequently enough, so that's nice. Um, I really liked that it had a hood. It's also a detachable hood, so that's nice too. But I really wanted, the hood was actually like kind of the main feature that I liked because actually yesterday it was raining all day and I was making sure that I was going out with something with a hood and I realized like I don't really have that many jackets with hoods, so Anyways, um, yeah, it was 40 euro, but at, well, the tag says 40 euro, but when I went to check out, it actually rang up for 20 euro, so that was kind of a nice little surprise. Um, but yeah, I really like this. I like the color. I like neutral colors. I generally like jackets that are shorter. I mean, not cropped. I mean, I guess you could almost say this is cropped. It is quite short. It, you know, kind of sits right at the waistline. But yeah, I mean, long jackets are good too, of course, sometimes, but yeah, that's that. And I will show me trying it on. Um, the next thing I bought is actually another jacket. Um, this I got a really good deal on too. This was in the sale section. Um, it was 27 euro. This is from Bershka. I actually just wore this out yesterday too. Um, I like that this one also has the um, adjustable bottom that you can kind of cinch it up. I don't know if that's the right word, but yeah, you can adjust that. Um, this doesn't have a hood and that was the one thing that I kind of wish it did have. Other than that, I really like it. It's really warm. Actually, it's like almost so warm that like even when I'm sitting in the car I was getting really warm and yeah I got this in a size medium I probably could have done a size small I actually just grabbed the medium and just tried the medium on and I really liked the way it fit was fine um yeah it zips and buttons it has pockets felt like there was one last thing I wanted to say about it but anyways I don't know that that yeah I really like this oh it's you know a relatively it, this one is like really almost like kind of cropped length. Um, I'll put a picture or sorry, a video of me trying it on here. So yeah, you can see it's kind of short, but I, I really like that for the most part. That's generally what I look for. So I really like that. And yeah, I thought that was a good find. Okay, the next item are these shoes that I got from Zara. These were 40 euro. Um, I got them in size 39. <laughs> I don't know, that doesn't really matter as much when it comes to shoes. Um, yeah, I had been wanting a pair of loafers for kind of a while. There was two, there was, yeah, I had my eye on um, actually another pair and that's what I went in there for. And then I saw these ones. Um, I can link the other pair too. They were really cute. They were 50 euro. Um, I decided to go with these. The other one were was more of like a shiny material on the top here, but I liked that it had no metal on those ones. So those are a great option too, but yeah. I mean, these feel well made, good for the price. It's not too much else to say about these. I mean, these are nice. I have some jeans that I'm like always kind of unsure what shoes to wear with them. Um, so I think these will look nice. Um, they look really cute with like um, a skirt and black tights and kind of 
yeah, you can kind of dress them up or dress them down, I feel like. So yeah, I'll also put a clip of me trying these on here. And these are the shoes. Pretty comfortable. Um, I'm usually size 40. These are size 39. So actually, I guess that is one thing to note. They could run a little bit big. The one time I wore them out, they were starting to hurt my feet just a little bit, but I'm still glad that I went with this size. Sometimes shoes just need to be broken in. Okay, and then the next two things, um, I actually kind of got them to go together, but you definitely, they both can go, they're both very like versi versatile, versatile, versatile. Um, they both can be made into a lot of different outfits. They're both like um, basic classic pieces. But anyways, so the first, that I'll show is this black skirt from Zara. I've actually already washed this, so. Well, I guess it's not that wrinkly, but it is ruched. So yeah, I feel like it's kind of looking funny on the camera right now, but that's one of the things I really liked about it was the ruching with like a tighter skirt or a dress when it has that ruching, it always makes me feel a little bit more comfortable on the midsection, like it's a little bit more forgiving when it has that ruching. If you're not feeling, I mean, you should wear whatever you want, whenever you want, no matter your size or how you're feeling, it doesn't matter. But um, if you're feeling a little bloated or something, sometimes I think like the ruching is kind of, makes me feel a little bit more comfortable if I'm wearing something kind of tight. So anyways, yeah, I really, really like this. This is like a great basic. I've kind of been wanting something like this for a while. Um, yeah, it's nice that it's a skirt, um, but it really looks like a skirt from the front. Um, skirts are obviously nice, so you don't have to be like quite as cautious about the way you sit and whatnot. Um, it zips on the side. It's not really um, elastic or anything, but yeah, I got this in a size small. And then I also got this shirt from Zara. This I've already actually has a crease because I was hanging it dry on the clothes horse. I actually washed this too already but um i love basic pieces with like just a little bit of flare um like this neckline i consider flare being a square neckline um and i loved like i love the ribbed material i just feel like it just kind of like jazzes up like a basic piece i love basic kind of fitted t-shirts or long sleeve tees and yeah i got this in a size small there's not too much else to say about it but it's really cute they do have this in other colors as well. I, if I really like something, and this was only like, I think 12 or 13 euro. So I like scanned the tag and went on the app. Once I got home and saw that, I'm pretty sure it comes in green and black as well. The next item is actually this like crew neck oversized sweater that I'm wearing now, sweater jumper. This was from Pull and Bear. I got it in a size medium and I just, I had wanted something that was kind of neutral and oversized and just good to wear with leggings. Um, I'll do a video of me standing in the mirror so that you can kind of see how it looks with leggings, but it's pretty much just a basic kind of crew neck sweater, but I really like it. I think it was 18 euro, so pretty affordable. Um, and if you're here for women's fashion, this is probably won't interest you too much, but um, if you're a mom or if you're out there shopping for any kids, I just picked up these two, um, they're the same, but different colors, leggings for my girls. Um, I don't know, I just thought they're worth mentioning because if you do have kids, like it's a nice, thick, durable legging. Um, I usually, I've often picked up leggings for the girls from Pennies and it'll be like a two pack for five euro, which is obviously so affordable, but like a lot of times it'll get a hole in the knee or somewhere in the legging within the first time or two of wearing so yeah almost like no point to even buying those so anyway so I appreciate when I find kind of a more durable legging my kids aren't even that rough and um they just get holes in their leggings quite easily so I think these are a good buy and they were eight euro so I mean obviously that's more than like three euro but it's it's worth it I mean they mainly only wear leggings anyway so and I really love the colors Okay, and then the last thing is this jacket that I got from H&M. I actually got this two weeks ago, but I figured I'd just include it because I was in there today and they still had several and it's kind of a good neutral basic piece. Um, I have, it's almost the same one, but it's a brown 
plaid pattern um, that I also got from H&M as well. That one was 40 euro. This is 28 euro. So it's also kind of um, a, a pretty good price. I think a lot of them are usually in the 40 euro range from what I, what I kind of notice when I'm out and about and shopping. But yeah, this will, the color's great and it's just handy. I kind of, you know, wear it as a light coat. So I'll put a video of me um, trying it on. Okay, it is 20 minute later, Steph. Actually, I was coming upstairs to get dressed to go out to dinner. And I forgot that when I bought the jacket, I also bought these jeans from Zara. They are um, mid-rise um, straight leg jeans that are like 100% cotton, so no stretch. Um, so the buttons, I really like them. I really like the wash. I like the little bit of distress around the edges and at the bottom. I will insert a clip of me trying them on. I got them in a size a US 6, I believe it's a UK 10, Europe 38. Um, I nine out of 10 times wear a size four and actually get a size eight in um, UK or Ireland sizes, but I wanted these to kind of have a looser fit and because they have no stretch, it's also a bonus with going a size up. Um, and I think with Zara things, I actually do, Zara's pretty true to size for me. I do generally get a size small and everything or a size four, but I wanted to size up with these pants. They are a little bit big. I could have worn the size smaller, but I wanted to go with the size that was larger because I didn't mind them having like the baggier fit. Okay, and that's it for my little haul. Um, I Like I said, I will link everything I can down below. I think everything should still be available. I just, I just, everything was purchased this week and this was purchased a couple weeks ago, but like I said, I actually just saw it in the, at H&M as well. Um, if you happen to have any questions, you can leave them down below. Like I said, I think mostly everything I got in a small, besides I got the Bershka coat and the medium. And yeah, um, if you like this video, please give it a thumbs up and I would appreciate it if you would subscribe to my channel. And I will see you guys in another video. Bye.